Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer Windows 8.1 and install software and apps to a new hard drive. First, let's go to Disk Management. Make sure that the disk is installed. So right-click this PC, Manage, Disk Management. Now, notice my disk 0, which is my main drive, C drive. This is where I have my operating system and data. I'm going to transfer that to disk 1. Now, notice that my disk 1 is 60 gigs, but if I right click my C drive properties, all it matters is the space used on my C drive or main drive. In this case, it's 10.6 gigs, so my disk 1 would be good enough. With that said, I'm going to go ahead and OK here and exit disk management. Now, to transfer my operating system to my new drive, I'm going to use Paragon Hard Disk Manager 14 Suite. This is a free program, but every time you run it, it'll ask you to pay for it. This is the one I'm using, the free version. So once downloaded and installed, go ahead and run it. Yes to the UAC. And here, select Migrate OS. Now, you should read the welcome screen. All it says, it'll delete all data on the destination drive, replacing it with the operating system. The wizard will auto detect your main drive and the destination drive, as you can see here. Windows 8.1 NTFS with 10 gig use space is going to transfer to disk 1 and is going to occupy 18% of that drive. You can check mark use all available space for the partition with OS or leave it blank. I'm going to go ahead and leave it blank and click on copy. The copy process can take a while depending on how big is the space used on your main drive. Now once done, you should read this carefully. All it says is that you should change the boot sequence in the BIOS if you're planning on keeping both drives to boot from the destination drive, not the source drive. In my case, I'm just going to keep the destination drive and remove the source disk. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off the computer, remove the source disk, and restart just using the destination drive. So I'll be back. Perfect. Now I'm booting up in the newly installed drive, which is a 60 gig drive. Now notice here everything is exactly the same even my shortcuts on my desktop. If I go to disk management, you'll notice that I'm only using my 60 gig hard drive. There it is. Now, notice that partition that says 30 gig unallocated. That's because we didn't check mark use all available space when we were copying the operating system. Now, you can reclaim this partition if you want all you need to do is right click your C drive, extend volume next to the wizard, make sure that the partition is selected, click next, finish. That's it. Now you have reclaimed your partition and you're using the entire hard drive. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.